Okay, the fight has started. We need to pause because otherwise we're going to be in trouble. This needs to go up. Uh, these need to uh, aim. And then they need to come forward. And this one, these these ones need to come quite far forward just because of the, the Gatling cannon. You're already leaking. I do not like that. I need... Well, okay, we got to wait for the orders. To, okay, now we got the orders. Okay, so that's where we directly want to be above, right in the middle here. Can we encourage them to shoot at us? Oh, oh, that's one down. All right, let's move you and you so you don't get in each other's way. Likewise, as soon as you have orders, come forward. And... I honestly don't mind if they're busy distracted by... Well, actually, let's get even closer. Okay, you guys, drop. Yeah, aimed fire. You're leaking, which I don't like. Oh, no. All right, come right forward then. And you two, yeah as far forward as you can as well it's practical you can get friendly fire on certain types of weapons i believe i don't think it's a problem at present but oh man these cultists are bad news and we of course don't have any repairs or anything on this vessel and i'm okay with that oh that is a lot of damage i'm okay with no repairs these things are cheap even our whoa even oh no Oh no, even our bomber is pretty cheap. Can it still fire from up there? I think it... It can, it doesn't matter. We have won. It's not perfect, but I think this is a victory. Yes, it is. Nice. Bumblebee grounded, Bumblebee grounded. And the dung beetles survived and the cultists are destroyed. Wow, the leader of the cult executed. Followers sent for religious re-education. Their towers are raised to the ground, so the cults turn out to, objects turn out to be gold. <sighs> oh, okay. So now is definitely the time for a couple of bumblebees. We'll say three of them, and then I think dung beetles two, and then up here, uh cultists were suppressed let's move here and repair and refit since they do have a large shipyard you can move here as well and do we need to do repairs yes that can be repaired this one can be refit did did i do i love this iterative whole i love this iterative thing taking a design it feels realistic in a game where I'm flying airships over a strange uh, landscape with um, cultists and stuff. You know, it's just everyday things. But look, I could refit all of those ships to being quite good for a cheap price. I think we'll have one of the strongest fleets in the game. And we're going to come slicing in this way and we're going to finish some, some people off. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. So, what do we got here? Like, look at that. Bam. We've got a fleet. Pretty much instantly. Um, and the bump, the bumblebee with that Gatling cannon is, is pretty perfect for all of the possible uses we could have. I actually haven't checked down here. Oh, yes. Uh, this is actually... Oh. No. Uh, no. <sighs> Cancel. Uh, refit. I actually want to open the other... No, that one. Watchful turret. Uh, refit. And then I want to put in this little defensive structure thing of me. There we go. Um, we've got to remember these little towns down here. Built building, defensive structure. Uh, but where are we going to put you? There's fine. Got to, we've got to keep those ones in mind as well, or we will have a hard time. So, I'm tempted to go for the capital. I've got one, two, three of those. 
if I take one more bomber, leave that one, leave that one, leave that one, leave that one, and these guys will move there. Yeah, you do a refit. Uh, open design, get all of these refitted done. And refit. I wonder if refitting is like the secret. If, is that the is that the power technique? Because if you think about it, it's really cheap, and I've pretty much doubled the effectiveness ish of these designs. Yeah, um, it's going to be worth a spy. Oh. Uh, I think I can take these. These are just... Uh, I think... I think I can take them. We're going to find out. Let's do it. Let's do it. We're going to have a go. Oh, he sent more people there. Oh. Okay, we can't do that. <laughs> All right, we're going to move back over. Maybe we'll just invade up to there. <gasps> what? What is this? Um. Okay, we're, we're just going to flee all the way back to here. That's a huge fleet. Uh, and one of our ships was weirdly broken. Um, now, we'll just refit this one. We're, we're going to, I think maybe we'll go the other way. <laughs> Yeah, I think uh, maybe we'll go the other way. You know what? Let's see what... The dragons have been defeated. Uh, like, I'm real. Uh, I think we're going to go this way. I'm really worried about, um, like, just how uh, deadly... I'm going to move some ships around. I'm just a bit worried about how deadly the big guys are there. Uh, this one we can absolutely do. This one's going to be easy peasy. So let's just rack our lads up in our standard assault formation with extras at the back. And start. Move straight up. Close with the enemy. I, I kind of... Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do about all those ships. Those were... How are they How are they looking? Well, no, normal shots are fine. That's fine. Okay, so you guys... Oh, we're still waiting for your orders to refresh. I should have sent you a bit closer. And straight up there. Speed things up a little bit. And you guys can probably afford to get even closer. Oh, this should be very quick. Yeah, that's that simple pimple. No problem at all. Gentle takeover. And what 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 is this? There's a tiny kingdom here with a shipyard. So you can stay there, Bumblebee. And this one can swing around here first. Is it, what is that? Oh, yeah, okay. That, I don't even know what those Jolly Towers are, but I know they're not very good. I don't even think we need to be fancy here. We don't need fancy assault formations. We're going to get lazy and just rack up. So you uh, just go straight up over here. That can be your one order because you're so slow and you guys just blam. Like, <laughs> look at all that grape shot. That is just ridiculous. It's not... Okay, they already surrendered. Gentle takeover. And yeah, we'll leave one of you behind. And then we'll invade over here. Oh, a little different. I still feel confident that we can do this. Um, I'm just going to say start. Go straight up here. Yeah. And you guys... And you guys get nice and close. Like those grape shot cannons. Why are you facing the wrong? That half of their stuff is facing the wrong way. I, I don't know what's going on there. 
Alright, come a bit closer. Uh, you guys... I'm gonna, I think I'm just gonna leave you at normal fire, to be frank. That seems fine. Oh, you're grounded. That's okay. I will move you slightly forward, though. And you even more forward. Alright. Have you all got something to shoot at? Essentially. Oh, there's a whole other bunch over here. Okay, fine. Move over here. Move over here. Alright, hang on. Aim shots. And... Alright. It might be up to the bombers. But I do want to get a bit closer to make those grape shots a little bit more worthwhile. Alright. Nice and close. Try and... Okay, try and avoid. Try and avoid. Okay, fine. You... You do your thing. And uh, more bombers. Get over. Alright. We're running low on ammo. Well, of course you are. You're lying on the ground. Very low on ammo. That's also fine. Ah, oh, whoops. Don't. Don't drag your tail. Okay. Alright, uh, so one ammo left. That's... That was the last of the ammo. Ammo's out. Oh, wow. Well, we got them all. Yeah, okay. Wow. That was awesome. Gentle takeover again. And... We'll leave you behind while we invade this way. This is going swimmingly... And I have enough of the fleet to leave ships behind without caring. And I, I find that does usefully distract the AI, I think. If you leave unguarded territories, they absolutely will walk in. And you don't want that. Do we want to go... Probably doesn't make a difference. We'll just go straight in. Yeah, it's a tougher one than the last one. Is that brick? I think it's brick. And this is just going to move over and then go up, which is a touch annoying. And we set the base on fire. That seems to be a weak, a weak point. Oh no, of course the first thing it does is take out that. The top one at that. Can we even get out of it? No. Maybe. No, maybe not. We're carrying two... We're carrying, carrying them on our backs. We should be able to escape with that. We, we we're doing just fine there. Uh, normal, fi normal fire. And you... Oh, wow. I mean, that's, that's just... Yeah, we got it. So one of the bumblebees was grounded. And another gentle takeover. Oh, a select research we got. <sighs> we got the... We don't want that one. We've got, we've got the suspendium. I don't even need propellers right now. Do I need rockets or marines? Hmm. I think rockets. All right. So we've lost. Okay, hang on. Ah, so there's the fleet there. Uh, does anything need repairing? Uh, I'm going to move stuff back here. Although I suspect I can't do any... Yeah, I can't do any repairs just yet. Until that gentle takeover has happened. Oh, what? Ungarden? Where's that? Uh, oh. So, red and... Uh, bug thing have formed an alliance which is oh it's that that's not that's not much of a threat to be perfectly frank 
Yeah, I'm okay with that. It's, it's time probably for us to use this suspendium uh, stuff. Okay, okay, I get it. Tell me, leave it me, leave me alone, game. Okay, yep, starting fleet, yep, 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 that's fine. Okay, good, yes, okay, thank you. So, Spurni Spurniac is fully recovered. This thing... Mm, okay, I mean, it's terrible, but it's not different it's not too disgusting so we'll leave that one these ones are still recovering you're okay there okay so you are these these are just bad they feel bad and they should should be bad especially without a cannon or anything so we'll leave it like that defenses uh, repair We'll scrap these four little, one gold little tiny buildings, these little defensive rubbish piles, and uh, put that there. And this one is almost done. So this one can be repaired, and I feel very safe down there. Oh, actually, no. Uh, move to there. I want to make sure nothing else needs repair. Nope, they're good. Move to there. The Grand Fleet can assemble itself. And we can work our way up the side of the map. I don't even think we actually need to worry. Okay, fine. Go over there. I was hoping that... Okay, we'll just scrap that. Uh, the Watchful Turret is still potentially helpful. And it's kind of cheap. And defensive structure as well. Yeah. Um, I still want to leave one of these guys behind. So we'll leave one of them behind and send the rest off. So we'll send one to there. And then... Oh, actually, no. What am I doing? Do that. And you lot can invade this way. We'll leave a ship behind, a ship behind. It's night time, so weapons are not going to be as accurate. That's okay. I think we've we actually got a bit of space now, so I can space these out a little bit more. And all right, so you, we've got lots of you guys now, straight up over here, and you lot uh, straight in over here. All right, let's have a look, bumblebees. Oh, they just gave up. Okay. Good. Leave one of you behind and the rest can invade this way. Yeah. Ooh. Can we take those? I'm willing to try. It feels like a bit of an ask, to be perfectly frank. If we start right at the back, we might have a chance. So the light is uh, from the west, so from the from the left. Uh, so we, we do have a little bit of an accuracy bonus there. We want accurate shooting, guys, so be careful. All right. These are going up. I mean, these are not very strong, and those bombs are going to just have a fantastic time. Come on. Come on. Give me my order ability back. And again, we're going to have to tell these guys to aim. Are we going to lose many of them? That's the question. Okay, come on. You can do it. Oh, I want to I wanna aim. I want to aim <laughs> okay they are really not good uh, let's just shuffle along a little bit chaps oh, okay we'll just wait they're not hitting us up here the rifle fire does nothing and we ha we are slightly armored so you know that's why we don't really even need the repair bay I mean I imagine it's is it helpful is anyone repairing are they doing anything 
And it has a health bar. I, I, I think that means like how many tools have been used, but it's not really causing any significant issues. Move over two ships. Just progress down the line. I want to make sure these hits are really effective. Alright. You guys. Like, I don't know if the Gatlin Cannon is helping there. I'd like to think it is. We've only actually kind of eliminated three of them so far. But we do have a lot of ammo in those bombers, so I'm confident we'll be okay. Let's speed things up a little bit. How much ammo have you got? Oh, yeah, let's back off. Back all the way off. I think that's it <laughs> for those guys. All right, and you lot just shuffle along a bit more. Let's carpet bomb them. It's kind of mean, but, you know, what can you do? Uh, move, escape. You are all going to run out of coal if you're not careful, so... Oh, no, they don't need coal, of course. What am I saying? They are, they are flying ships. That is uh, quite a good point for their sustainability. Yeah, they don't have to worry about running out. They can just hover on the map. Come on. Reserve. Okay, so how are the bombers doing? Let's check. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh wow, one of them is a little bit in trouble. So I think he is going to come back over this way. They all survived, and one surrendered. <gasps> nice. Oh, I am pleased. Gentle takeover. Is that... What are we looking at here? We have... All three of them up? I did this one. I did. This one is getting its defenses. Now, it's really also time we start building some uh, much bigger ships. And oh, something with cannons. Please, game. Oh, not just those rubbish ones. Uh, do we want to... No. It, mm, okay, so. Oh, we do actually have... that. Is, that is the one we have. I wasn't sure. So that one... Okay. Fine. We'll scrap all these little ones. And... Six, yeah. I'm, we're going to have to put some actual cannon ones in because I don't want these little guys anymore. Maybe this one more here. Uh, it's kind of they, they are cheap, so and I would like yeah, and no, I would actually like one of those. All right, that's a lot of building. And do we have repairs to do? I'm just amazed that we just really don't. So the next target is Sour. But what we really want to be doing is building... A build, a building a big ship, but I kind of think maybe we want one with rockets. So... For now... Maybe the Bumblebees are just fine. And uh, a couple more of them wouldn't go amiss and probably with a uh you know what i'm actually gonna send uh, i'm gonna send two of them down to here i feel like it is an investment in uh, safety oh look these people have revolted i wonder how strong they are but i don't really want to tackle that island just yet i want to go do one more blast over here and what Okay, oh, so we have a fight. And what, you don't look too well. And I thought you were you were fine, but you don't look great. Uh, you should probably just surrender now. I think that would be just safer for everyone. I uh, will crank that up and move you guys forward. We far outclass the enemy. Yes, that is true. We really do. This is a bad enemy and they should feel bad. And gentle takeover. 
We control all of this space. That is a lot of stuff. Hang on. What? Oh, there's actually a tiny little... Okay, that was, that was confusing. There's a tiny little province right here. So we need to let this run so we can complete the takeover, capture the spot, uh, build up its defenses, and then go and just capture that final spot. Um, repair, sure. Uh, move that one there, scrap that one, and put in a, a, a better tower. I know it's terrible. We'll design something better later, but for now it's a, just a deterrent, really. Wait for that repair to come through. And invade. And again, yeah, I'm just going to move forward like that and move uh, up like this. You know, actually, I almost kind of like the fact that these don't use coal. I mean, they're just a really cheap, effective bomber. Bam, you just take, you know, simple places really effectively. So fleet move back to here all right so rockets are done and it's time to think about the next sort of thing we build um we're still facing a lot of rubbish and i quite like the idea of getting into some of the taking stuff over so we'll go for the other basic tech up there also because it gives us fire extinguishers which is nice and I think that's probably enough for this episode. I think uh, we've cracked, we've cracked these guys in half. Uh, we're doing pretty well. We've got so much money. It's time. Whose spy is that? Oh, it's our spy still there. Oh, that is, that's big. But you know what? I think we can build stuff to take that on. I think flamethrowers and heavily armored stuff would do well. As well as perhaps a properly defended, yeah, a properly defended bomber and a, and a heavier class of bumblebee. One which doesn't rely on uh, air balloons, I think would do very well. Our current fleet is excellent for taking on lightly uh, weaponed peoples. But as soon as they mass their, um, as soon as they mass cannons or start massing gunfire, then we're going to lose because they're going to pop all of our pop of all our balloons and we'll all fall over. That being said, I am all in favor of heavy, heavy defensive... No, not defense, not those. Heavy defensive uh, structures. And so we're going to have a bunch more of those built. And that's going to be... In the next episode, we're going to build ourselves a big bomber and a decent assault craft. I hope you'll join me. Until then, I've been Tiny Pirate. Good night. Good night.